Hi folks and welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing fantastically well out there. In this video, we're going to have a look at a cheap vintage style overdrive. So this is the Kimis Overdrive. So it's time for a little review. I got this off eBay a little while ago. I mean... <laughs> I just saw it on, on the Kimis uh, eBay store. Yeah, it was pretty cheap at the time. And if I remember rightly, you could put an offer in. So I put an offer in, including postage. It cost me about £10, give or take. Now, I have had a look before starting recording this video. The price has gone up, but you can still make an offer. So it's if you like this pedal it's worth see if you can find it on ebay i got it in ebay in the uk i'm sure they've got a store on the us and canadian and everywhere else ebay's let's uh, plug this in and see what it sounds like we've got the pedal plugged in I'm going into the uh, the joy old zombie into the Arley benton cab so i'm gonna start it off on the clean channel now the pedal itself has got your typical dials it's got your gain your tone and your volume at the minute i've just got it in in the sort of typical overdrive settings tone at 12 o'clock drive all the way off volume all the way up so like i say we'll start off on the clean channel so without the pedal on So yeah, it is sort of adding a little bit of gain in there, sort of giving you that sort of rock sound. Let's have a look at the tone to start off with. So all the way to this side. I'm sort of liking it around about two o'clock ish. But let's push the amp a bit more with the gain knob. So it's all the way off at the minute. And this is all the gain. Mm, not a lot of difference in there. So, switch that back off. We'll reset it back to the typical sort of overdrive settings. Oh, on the gain channel without the pedal on. Uh, I've got. I've, I've only got the gain at nine o'clock ish. Tone at three o'clock. Volume's about halfway up. Yeah, it does sort of bring some aggression and tightens that low end up. Let's put that 
it's on to about eight o'clock, uh, eight o'clock, two o'clock-ish again. <laughs> Yeah, ah, so I like it about there. Now let's have a let's dial this gain in a bit because I think we can just push it just a little bit more. <laughs> For me, that's my sort of ideal settings for me personally. They're, they're, they're them sort of sweet spots for me. There you go, folks. That was the Kimis Vintage Overdrive. What do I think about this thing? Does it get the wizard's seal of approval? Or does it get the finger of doom? Drum roll, maestro. Well, for me, yeah, it does get the wizard's seal of approval. Now, when I first got this, I tried it out. I was a bit meh at first. Tried, tried it in a couple of different amps, and then I started messing about dialing it in and i think it sounds pretty good especially for the money it is a pretty solid little pedal it's uh it's well built i've got to admit that i'd say for the price i paid for it i think for all all in all i think i paid about 10 11 pound for this all in all i'd say the price has gone up a little bit on ebay i think they're around about 22 pound now but you can make an offer on them so it's well worth putting an offer in. But anyway, let me know what you guys think about this down in the comments. I will leave a link to the uh, eBay page as well down in the description. And if you want to get up yourself some evil wizard merch, then it's a link to the merch store down in the description. But that's all from me, folks. I'll catch you in the next one. <laughs> Right, folks, I hope you enjoyed that video. You can follow me on social media and you can get my music online. And if you want to support the channel, there's uh, Buy Me a Coffee and PayPal links. They're all down in the description. Click up here to subscribe and click the link down there for videos that you may not have seen. Keep it loud and keep it heavy.